course, uh, Super Rugby starting this weekend. Everyone, the whole of South Africa can't wait. It kicks off tomorrow and we've been catching up with some of the teams just to find out how exactly they are doing ahead of the tournament right now. Let's find out what the Lions have to say. The Golden Lions returned to Supersport Rugby after knocking out the Southern Kings in last year's relegation battle. But after a year's absence and dismal past performances, will the Lions be able to claw their way back into the top fight or will they be left with their tails between their legs? The current team has two Springbok caps and holds a solid mix of Curry Cup caps and young talent. But with little Super Rugby experience in their depths, the task to step up on the biggest rugby stage in the Southern Hemisphere will prove difficult. 10, 11 guys is going to play the first Super Rugby uh, on, on, the, on the weekend. It is a challenge, but then, uh, you know, uh, Etzebed has proven to us uh, at a young age that he could step up in, in, a, in a year later to be a Springbok. And in the past, the Jakut Tauta and the Franz Sostein. So, you know, each individual must just have that self-belief and we as a group must have that belief. And, and the quicker they will start believing that they can play at that level, hopefully we'll make a few upsets. It's tough to actually prepare them for that pressure situation within Super Rugby. But within our trainings, I think the coaches have put us under pressure situations just to prepare us for it. But we know that it's a tough competition and yeah, so we just can't wait to, to get going. Opening bout against the on-form Cheetahs in Bloom and then hosting a Springbok-laden Stormers at Alice Park will give the tail of the tape for the Lions. But massive clashes against the Chiefs and Crusaders might just be the knockout blow. I think the Chiefs is a... Uh, Amazing challenge for us, you know, they're an exciting bunch of players, play attacking brand of rugby, so always great to play them. But coach Ackerman is realistic about his expectations this season and believes with time and team stability, the Lions will stand up in the Super Rugby. We will be better coming next season, for example, just with the experience that the, each individual will pick up uh, this season. Hopefully we won't lose uh, again five, six, seven, eight players at the end of the season. And we obviously believe that we've got a certain strength and, and we'll play to that. But um, I think hopefully we as a team will challenge all the teams in, in all areas, you know, I, I think um, I've got a team that's willing to work hard and, and, and that in general will, will hopefully do them well against other teams. The Lions have a rich history in the annals of Super Rugby, but lifting silver might be far-fetched this season. With a dwindling spectator attendance and not having secured a shirt sponsor as of yet, shows there's little confidence in the team, both on and off the field.